Omas is just so big that you have to be a bit suspicious, right? Um, just from a sheer size standpoint. Uh, the guy that Pat McAfee uh, has mentioned a couple of times as the alpha of our species, and if aliens came, we would send him to you know kind of show what our species is about. Maybe he's not of our species. Maybe that explains why, and that's Brock Lesnar. I mean, the guy is just one of one, total freak of nature, uh, athlete, mentality, toughness, just big, strong, manly. I mean, just there's definitely you could you could see him being from a different planet for sure yes um you know otis otis sometimes has his own language <laughs> you know that could be some sort of alien form of language i'm not sure about that uh might need to look into that a little deeper um those know, seem like good that, those that, seem like yeah those seem like good ones yeah, I'll, I'll throw two more out to you that i think are possible uh john okay. cena he's not current but John Cena does seem kind of robot-like sometimes, so I could see mm, that yeah. it's maybe just alien. True. Okay. And the second or maybe one, an alien robot. I or, mean, you know, maybe the aliens have advanced AI and good, they've created this human. That, good point. They've created the John we can't Cena rule bot. It out. We can't rule it we out. We can't rule it out. I like yeah. the way you're thinking here. You're a deep thinker, and I like it. And secondly <laughs> is Rick Boogs. I think Rick Boogs. Oh like, my God! He seems to me like he like he's of another planet for sure. He's eating cat food sometimes. Like he's yes. he's doing he's screaming in his garage at all hours of the night. I think that he has to be a contender for an alien. Yeah, I mean the most extreme person I've ever come across. <laughs> 